What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Unique Queen, and I'm back with another video. And as y'all can see from the title, y'all already know what is about to go down. I got a little life update for you guys. How I've been feeling mentally, how I've been doing physically, and all that good stuff. So make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And please go show love to all of my previous videos on my channel. And yeah, y'all already know the drill. If you're already subscribed, mwah, much love, girl. Hey, hey. And yeah, um, I'm going to just get right into it what is up y'all how y'all been how y'all been first of all let me just tell y'all how i've been like let me just tell y'all how i've been feeling mentally where my head is at and all that good stuff so how i'm feeling mentally like i feel like like i feel like i'm just going through so much stuff like with myself with my relationship with my family like family issues and like i said my relationship and it's just a lot for me to handle like i'm still young yeah i'm 20 but i'm still young you know like everybody goes through hardships everybody goes through something and it just is natural like you know but it's just how you cope with it it's how you deal with it and i've been telling myself like girl you got this like i i started to read the bible and you know just try new things and ways to cope with how i'm feeling mentally and stuff like that and i can say like the bible has been a very good healthy help if that makes sense like i don't know how i was trying to say it but like god has really just helped me these past couple days get through what i've really been going through like even if it's a little bit of helping me get through it like me just being able to communicate with the lord and talk to the lord and just get a better feel and get a better understanding it just really helped me like so i advise to y'all like if y'all are going through anything y'all struggling to talk struggling to get through anything go to the lord talk to the lord like he's always listening he's always there and that's where a lot of people mess up at like they feel like oh god's not real god's not there and from my experience i can say like god is real like i believe god is real like he put miracles in my life he put hardships in my life he put stuff that i couldn't control stuff that i couldn't handle like but i still got through it and i really thank the lord for that but i don't want to get all into the lord and stuff like that because this ain't no church channel or nothing like that but i just want y'all young people and y'all older people to like read the bible and actually talk to the lord because he's really listening and he'll really work something out for you like i'm telling y'all but where i am mentally like i'm going through things like i said family issues my relationship dealing with myself um but i'm managing to get through it i'm managing to take every day one step at a time like deal with one thing one step at a time um so yeah like like i said everybody goes through something everybody handles it differently i went to the bible i talked to god about it and um i'm slightly okay like i'm not as down as i was for the past couple of days like i mean only when i was sick because like no, I did not have COVID because, like, people been asking me, like, do you got COVID? Do you got COVID? Because you're sick. Do you got COVID? <laughs> do you got COVID? <laughs> like, no. <laughs> no, I don't. Like, I just had, like, a, a little stomach bug and it, like, messed up my stomach to where, like, it made me throw up and stuff like that. Like, that's it. I didn't have COVID. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, y'all, I just had to get that laugh because people really be asking me like do i got covid and like that's not it like i don't got covid i don't even know what that is like that's nowhere near my family coming in my family like like i said i pray over that type of stuff like i ask god to keep that type of stuff and virus away from my family and keep us protected and he's been keeping us protected none of my 
family members got COVID, none of that, like none of them passed away from COVID. Like we good over here, period. Anyway, new topic I wanna get on, like let's get into my hair for real, for real y'all. Like I did my hair about, I would say like two days ago. Um, This is how it looks y'all. Like, I really bodied it, like I did so good. Like, so I just wanna get into my hair, like y'all like like i was saying before i dropped my charger piece y'all like i just i did my hair two days ago and y'all like you know get into my hair for real like it's like so beautiful like but and like people ask me like girl how did you learn to do your own box braids and stuff like that and i always tell them like my mom taught me how to like attach the hair like the weave and stuff like that to the actual real hair so that's pretty much how i learned like and like i have like a history of like being locked up in the system and stuff like that so like me having to take care of my own hair really just helped me out on how to do my own hair if that makes sense like i've been doing my own hair since i was like i would say since i was like 16 maybe 16 or 17 i've been doing my own hair doing my own box braids doing my own tracks installing my own wigs like i really do that stuff but like and it it helps me get through things when I'm going through something when my mind's racing on something I pick up that comb pick up that brush pick up that grease pick up that can too pick up that weave pick up whatever is going to help me cope with what I'm going through and when I was going through what I was going through two days ago like I just was like I'm gonna go to the store buy some packs of hair and do my hair and that's what I did and this is how I came out amazing Hurts is all good. Yeah. Most of y'all didn't know that I had my nose pierced. I don't think any of y'all knew because I... Okay, y'all. So, let me tell y'all. So, I made a video for y'all or whatever. It was around, like, New Year's Eve. I made a video because I got my nose pierced on December 29th. And I made the video on, like, New Year's Eve or... Cause my birthday was january 2nd um so i wanted to have my nose pierced before my birthday so i got it on the 29th but i just forgot when i vlogged and i told y'all that i had my nose pierced and i showed y'all but i never got a chance to upload it because of my storage and stuff like that my storage was too full so i had to figure out a solution on how to get my storage like unclogged and stuff like that but yeah y'all i got my nose pierced oh it hurt it somewhat i love it oh i gotta clean that i gotta clean that y'all because that gross but yeah y'all it hurt it but i'm working on getting my other side done because i just absolutely love it like it's so cute on me it's just it's cute and i think my other side would be more adorable but y'all like honestly i want more piercings and i think like i'm gonna go for it like because that's just me you feel me and i'm 20 i can make my own decisions but i just want because i already got this side pierced so i want this side pierced i want my industrial oh y'all this is sharpie i was like putting my future tattoo right there because that's where i want my tattoo and that's that's the color that i want it as well so you know what i mean i was just practicing and stuff like that but it's smeared so but yeah y'all want my industrial done i'm on my other side of my nose pierced and then i was gonna get my lip repierced if y'all can't see that it's a dot right there that's where my lip was pierced i had the marilyn monroe but <sighs> that's another story time on what happened to my piercing or whatever and why it's out my face when it should be in my face but anyway y'all love my hair y'all like honestly really sorry. Like, i just want new piercings like because i think i look good with piercings which i think which i think do i look good with this nose piercing i think i look good with this nose piercing 
Hold on, I'm trying to turn it. Oh my God. Oh, it's right there. I think I look good with this nose piercing and I want my other side done. So I'm gonna just go for it. Like, if you want something done, you go for it. <laughs> like go for it don't don't listen to what people say people's negativity people's toxicness if you want to go for something if you think that's a good fit for you if you think that's a good job for you if you think it'll work for you make sure you go do it for you for you for you one more time for you not for anybody else it's nobody else's business it's nobody else's opinion on what you want to do for you so if I'm going to get my piercings and if I'm going to get my other side done, if I'm going to get my industrial, if I'm going to get my tat and all that, I'm going to go for it. Because it's me. It's my body. 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 But yeah, like, one thing I am going to tell y'all is don't just go getting a whole bunch of piercings on your face and then expect to go to a job interview and then you don't get the job because of how your face look. Because if you got this right here i see people that got this right here pierced if y'all got this right here y'all got both of y'all nose y'all got y'all cheeks pierced y'all got y'all lip pierced y'all got y'all industrial y'all got gauges ain't no job ain't no way in <laughs> a job is gonna hire you because like i'm if i was a hiring manager whatever supervisor boss whatever you want to call it and I'm interviewing somebody that has all them piercings and tattoos on them. I'm not hiring you. Especially if you got all them piercings on your face. Like, So just make sure y'all, it's called self-love and self-care. Like, I know self-love falls into getting piercings and stuff like that. Because, honey, this right here is self-love to me. Like, It just, it makes me look so good. Like, I really like it. Like, honestly, y'all. But, anyway, y'all, it's a new year new blessings new beginnings i'm working on that apartment i'm working on getting me a new car i have a car i just want a new one honestly i want a truck not like a big truck i want an suv because when it's snowing and stuff like that i need to be able to get through all that snow and get through what i need to get through because i can't do that with my nissan i can't go up hills in the snow with my nissan because I slide back down. So I need like a big body. Something big. If y'all get what I'm saying. Like, So you know what I mean. Like stay tuned. That apartment's coming. That new car's coming. The woman that I want to be is coming in no time. Like, And I'm also looking for a job. Because I need to get a job. If I want to get the things I want to get. I need to get a job to make it happen. And that's on period. So for you young ladies who aren't out here working like me. Just make sure you go get a job. Tomorrow's Monday. Go get a job. Because I am. I'm going to wake up bright and early to go get a job. Because when you're a woman, you can't just sit on your butt. You can't expect everything handed to you. And that's what I had to learn. Because I'm like a gimme, 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 gimme type of female. And I just had to learn like that's not good like you can't always be like gimme 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 like that's not how it works like you gotta get up on your own you gotta get up off of your <laughs> and really get to it like and that's what i had to realize so like i said i'm giving y'all some advice make sure y'all get up like if you don't got a job get up go get a job go get some money go get your own money so you don't gotta depend on family you don't gotta depend on your boyfriend that's where i messed up at always depending on my boyfriend and hey can you do this hey, can you do that hey, can you give me this hey, can you give me that hey, can you get this done for me hey, can you? like no nah. i don't want to do that no more i'd rather just have my own money do it my way like get it my way how i want it without nobody saying nothing like that's how i want it to be like so y'all better take my advice and get up off of y'all asses and get to that money because i'm speaking from experience being acting dependable and 
or other people and stuff like that that's not gonna get you nowhere but get judged you're gonna get judged oh she's always asking for that she's always asking for that she always wants that she always wants that she's always like give me give me give me give me give me like nobody likes that and like i said speaking from experience like <laughs> like i don't like it period and i just want to become a better woman and get on my own so i'm gonna do the right thing and i'm gonna go get a job so i can get that apartment get that car and like i said like be the woman that i envision me being because like i know i'm gonna be a boss when i get older period like i already know i'm gonna be a boss but y'all oh wait somebody's calling me my bad y'all my boyfriend called me it's like no but y'all like i was saying well what i was about to say y'all let me get into my face for real, for real because i've been using this witch hazel face wash and i also been using this daily cleanser i don't know if y'all ever heard of this kind y'all really need to get put one to this like i really just put y'all onto this like, y'all can get this from walmart target giant righty family dollars you only get this from anywhere like it's really a good face wash and the other one that i've been using the witch hazel one and they also have witch hazel like oil type stuff to put on your face so you won't break out and it clears up acne and stuff like that but i literally have the face wash so i moisturize it into my face and i just let it sit and then i put lukewarm water all over my face just to clear it off and like y'all see how my face look like i wish i can insert like uh I wish I could insert like a a picture. I probably will insert like a picture of how face. I mean, uh, I can't speak how clear my face really is. Like it honestly, where like I'm gonna do like a before and after picture. Like before, like how my face was like all broke out, had pimples and stuff. I mean, like I have like a little little pimples or whatever like something making me break out so little pimples but like getting to my cheeks and stuff like i had acne like everywhere on my face and now it's starting to clear up because of this stuff and my witch hazel face wash so make sure make sure y'all go get that from giant walmart target family dollar right like y'all can literally get it from anywhere like and it won't clog your pores it won't do any of that like it's legitimately a good wash <sighs> like i'm gonna keep y'all updated on like my face and how more of a clear look it's gonna get from weeks from now and y'all gonna be like oh my god like but yeah y'all i'm gonna insert a before picture of how my acne looked and how my face was all broke out to now and y'all gonna see like the difference and like i also wanted to let y'all know that like i'm gonna be coming out with like new videos for y'all like pranks and hygiene videos you know like showering routines um morning routines i really wanted to hop on a trend with the 5 a.m morning routine and i think i'm going to it's just that honestly like i'm not ever gonna lie to myself like it's gonna be really hard for me like i I'm not usually up around that time. <sighs> I don't want to lie to y'all for real, for real. Sometimes I'm up around that time, but like lately I've been like so tired. So it's like I'm, I don't see myself doing it like this week, but stay tuned because I really have a lot of videos coming to my channel. Like I said, pranks, hygiene videos, showering videos all that good stuff um and product videos as well like i want to show y'all some products that i use for like my body for my face lotions i use perfumes i use um whatever the case may be just anything hygiene materialistic stuff i want to make videos and show y'all and stuff like that so like i said just make sure y'all stay tuned to what's coming to my channel because yeah and i'm gonna also start doing hair videos um i wanted to vlog me doing this hairstyle but 
like I said, I was going through stuff. I just wanted a mental break, like away from the camera, away from people. I just wanted me around, me around, my weave around, my music around, <laughs> like my TV around. Like that's all like I really wanted around at that moment. So like I kind of didn't vlog and I should have vlogged just because I honestly did a very good job and I'm really proud of myself so the next time I'll be taking these out like I really just couldn't decide when I wanted to take these out but I'll keep y'all updated on when I'm gonna take them out it'll probably be like weeks from now I'm gonna try to keep them in for as long as I can probably like a month and a half and then decide to take them out because these are really tight and I want them to be tight and I want them to stay in so my hair can grow and I want to keep them in for a long period of time also so my hair can grow so I'm gonna update y'all on when I'm gonna be taking them out when I do take them out I'll do a wash day and stuff like that and y'all get to see the whole full I'll blow all of this so yeah but y'all like I I'm sorry for not being on camera as much. I'm not I'm sorry for not uploading as much. Like like I told y'all I was making videos but they're just sitting in my editing app because of my storage issue. But now that I have my storage back and everything's fine, cool and dandy, I'll be able to upload for you guys. Maybe every other day I'll try to post and upload videos do different videos content and all that stuff but i do apologize for and not being on camera for y'all because y'all know i love y'all for real my subscribers y'all know i love y'all and if like i say if y'all new subscribers please make sure y'all subscribe to my channel because i hope you grow out like for real for real like but i think y'all love it here once i start posting more videos upload uh why can't i speak to Anyway, um, like I was saying before, I, my words got mixed up. Um, I feel like y'all like really love it here once I start uploading more videos and more content, such as like pranks and you know hygiene routines and stuff like that. Um, I feel like y'all really enjoy it. So if y'all really like this video, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Like I was just talking about. Subscribe to your girl. Y'all already know the dilly. Oh, make sure y'all washing y'all. For real. Because we don't even play that. So make sure y'all wash your way. <laughs> it's like, uh, make sure y'all wash your way. My next video will probably be a shower routine, a hygiene routine. One of those y'all's gonna be glad about. So make sure y'all stay tuned, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Mm -hmm.